Okay, so, uh, so I'm gonna do this, and then you can come in at, right here on the B part. You are watching With a Cup of Tea, a production of This House of Books, an independent bookstore cooperative and tea shop in downtown Billings. Now, here's our show. Anyway, we have this book. I take it we're rolling. All right. Yes. yes. Hi. And I'm here with uh, Lynn Bowie, and, um, and you have a book. Yes. This is the uh, young agent version right. of Harry Potter and the Art of Spying. And my co-author is Peter Ernest, who is uh, 36 years CIA. Okay. Now the head of the International okay. Spy Museum. Oh, he's, he is In now. D.C. All right. So where did this book come from? Uh, it's originally, we did one in 2014, which we call the high school version. And that one's 833 pages and is much more, obviously, massive. And it, but it came from, I'm a lawyer in North Dakota, and I was listening to the CD of the fifth book as I was driving from Red Lodge, Montana to Bismarck on a regular basis, 500 miles door to door. And uh, I was listening to it, and I thought, wait a minute, this is all spy stuff. So I went back and re-listened, and we figured out all the spy stuff. I called up Peter, and I said, how'd you like to do a book? He said, sure. The rest, as they say, is history. Now, you, you called up Peter, the, the, uh, the founding director of the International Spy Museum. Yes. Did you know each other before that? We kind of threw another person. I, I didn't know him personally, but I knew of him. And then when I actually first called him, I thought he was somebody who had been on a, what we called a spy cruise through the Caribbean, where it was a, a boat, a, a cruise ship filled with nothing but former FBI, CIA, KGB, and we did a, a conference on spying, and every place we stopped, then we'd all go out and do other things. And so I actually thought he was another person that I'd met there. So when I called him up, I said, I gave him the pitch. He says, that sounds great, but I wasn't on that cruise with you. And he says, but I don't care, let's do it. <laughs> so okay. That, okay. that was a happenstance. Okay. A very, very happy happenstance. So you got to know him. Yep. Oh, yes, very well. Okay. So the premise of the book is, uh, well, tell me, what is the premise? Well, the, the premise or purpose of the book is just to go through the entire Harry Potter series, but in a more adult or high school level. And that makes it more interesting from a different perspective. And our perspective is, of course, the perspective of intelligence, work, and spying. So we go through book five initially, which is all, the, all about the, you know, the Order of the Phoenix and Dumbledore's army all those entities that are doing spycraft and how they use codes, how they um, listen in on people, all mm -hmm. that stuff, and how they use logic to figure out things, intelligence analysis. Okay. So that's what the book's about, both of them. The, the young adult version, uh, we call it the young agent edition, it has, you know, it has the mazes and puzzles and things like that, and this is more of a elementary school, junior high, and the other one is junior high to high. But both are equally uh, enjoyable to adults who like the Harry Potter series. Oh, okay. So it's definitely a cross. It's not just a young adult book. It's whoever's interested in Harry Potter should enjoy it. Well, thank you very much. My pleasure. It's nice being at this house of books. Yay. <laughs> This has been a production of This House of Books. If you'd like to be a part of the cooperative, please visit thishouseofbooks.com slash get involved.